In this week's Champlain Connection, Vermont's Department of Environmental Conservation is encouraging you to take steps to create a lake-friendly lawn, and a Shelburne-based business is doing its part. Today at American Meadows, which ships seeds and bulbs to gardeners, employees were shrinking the footprint of their lawn for their first ever Reduce Your Lawn Day. They were replacing some of the grass outside their office with wildflowers. A few thousand customers nationwide took a pledge to reduce their lawns this season. That kind of move, according to the Vermont DEC, should provide more habitat and food for pollinators. And it should reduce the need for watering because native wildflowers especially tend to be more tolerant to dry conditions. By the way, overwatering can actually lead to lake pollution by washing sediment and nutrients into the water. I've been doing this for over 30 years, and I can tell you the consumer who we talk to a day in and day out, they have never been more in tune with the environment, wanting to do something good for the environment, even if they don't know where to start, whether it's replacing a small piece of their lawn or wanting to plant vegetables and know where their food's coming from. This kind of reduce your lawn and planting wildflowers, we've really seen a big uptick. The DEC wants you to minimize or stop using fertilizers on lawns and landscaped areas, saying most Vermont lawns really don't need those. Regulations in both Vermont and New York prohibit using phosphorus fertilizers on your lawn in most cases because they contribute to poor water quality in waterways.